Hello, it's me again. Um, yes, I'm now wearing a headscarf due to the perceived radioactive conditions within my house from time to time. Um, I remember that uh, people who worked at round trees used to wear headscarves all the time as well and used to uh, go there on their bikes in York. Um, I was told that people used to go to the, um, the uh, railway carriage works on their bikes as well. Um, but I didn't actually witness that. I did witness a lot of people going to round trees on their bikes. Um, yeah, I just wanted to say as well about uniforms. Um, because it did seem to be a bit of a uniform, the headscarf, actually. Um, when I worked at Asda, um, down Jockey Lane in Huntington, in the staff canteen, um you know i was told off because i used to wear black tights um which like were sort of uh, i was accustomed to wearing um to follow the fashion because people in my family were nurses um now nurses for some reason used to have to wear black black nylon tights and black belts um, quite thick black belts whereas all the other workers like if you were in a canteen or whatever you were meant to wear brown tights um, and also like around trees I think you were meant to wear brown tights but why it should have been black tights for nurses and brown tights for everybody else I don't know but I used to get told off for wearing black tights at the staff canteen um, but, you know, I also have to say um, that when I worked at the staff canteen, um, like I do notice that a skin clinic has now opened up in York, um, where a news agency used to be, um, uh, uh, sort of on the corner of Blossom Street. And there was a girl there with very bad acne uh, at um, Asda, and I knew other girls with very bad acne. And I know that they were able to solve it. Um, they did put them on some medication for a short time that solved it completely. Um, you know, I will go on to uh, talk about more about another friend of mine who, who did suffer from acne. Um, well, I went well in re it, with things that are in relation to something that might concern him and his group of people um, but you know um, also I want to say that at, um, at the staff canteen um, yeah I remember Rita um, particularly actually um, who worked alongside me and she she yeah well yeah um, but also, um, the manager of Asda at that time was very young. She was a very young woman. She was only about 24 and she was the manager of the whole store. So, don't know about that. I just thought I'd leave that with you to uh, think about. Okay then, bye for now. Bye.